In this video, we will show you our current development of sensor system to support track geometry monitoring. Firstly, we will briefly introduce our motivation and objective. Next, we will present our development and results. Finally, we list the potential benefits and impacts of our development. Routine measurement of track geometry parameters is one of the most important inspection measures for railway infrastructure to ensure the reliability and the safety of the railway system. Nowadays, track geometry measurement is done by dedicated track recording coaches or modified vehicles equipped with the TGM systems. Due to the high investment costs and the maintenance issues, the availability of TGM systems in terms of the whole network is quite low. This results in a low measurement frequency. Infrastructure manager is looking for a more affordable and a robust solution for track geometry monitoring. This enables more efficient track maintenance and the improvement of the track reliability. Acceleration measurement has been identified as a good candidate due to its low cost and robustness. However, it has been proved in the previous studies that track irregularities in lateral direction cannot be accurately derived from acceleration due to the relative lateral motion of the wheel on the rear. Therefore, our objective is to develop a sensor system to measure the lateral displacement of the wheels on the rear. The sensor systems should be inexpensive and robust, allowing easily adaptation to different types of bogies. The developed sensor system is based on sterile vision, which was evaluated as the most promising in our previous studies. The sensor system includes a sterile camera based on the triangulation principle a camera hoisting equipped it with a lighting system, which consists of a series of LEDs, a fixing system consisting of a crossbar and a clamp, a processing unit based on, based on NVIDIA JSON TX2 for real-time edge computing. We demonstrate two kinds of uh, montage solution. The first one is based on the above mentioned crossbar and clamp. It is a very light and a space saving solution, which allows the sensor system to be fixed on different types of buggy frames. The structural calculations have shown that, despite its small size, the mounting solution is extremely robust and able to withstand shocks and vibrations during normal train operation. The second one is based on a mental frame holding the cameras and LEDs for both left and right sides. We conduct uh, two field measurements at low speeds in Italy and Lithuania respectively, in order to obtain real-world data and validate the mounting solution before moving on its final design and production. For this purpose, a prototype version of the sensor system has been installed on the buggy frame of the existing track recording coaches belongs to IFI and the Lithuania Railways, respectively. Next, we will overview the algorithm. The first step is the automatic calibration. Once the sensor system is installed on the buggy, we conduct the calibration. A deep neural model is used to automatically identify the wheel rear contact region and output the required parameters for next steps. During the operation, we use another deep learning models to identify predefined reference points on the wheel and the rear for each frame in real-time mode. To improve the detection accuracy, we track the detected points in adjacent frames. We detect the impossible point detections and introduce some domain knowledge 
to correct the implausible detections. At last step, the lateral distance between the wear and the real reference point is calculated by using DIPS information obtained by the sterile camera. The calculation algorithm was validated in the laboratory and static test with the measurement error less than 0.3 millimeter. The developed sensor system can be fused with the accelerometers to build a complete trap geometry measurement system at a high TIA level. The final system will have much lower costs in comparison to the state-of-the-art TGM solution. This will enable a large deployment on in-service trains and more frequent track geometry monitoring. And finally, more reliable track condition. Our development may raise the interest of the relevant railway companies in the area of TGM. Infrastructure manager will benefit from the proposed solution. The concept and the technologies behind our development could be transformed to other applications such as active wear control. Finally, we demonstrate the test results by two videos. As shown in the video, the illumination conditions and the vehicle speeds are different. In the left video, the vehicle runs at 20 km per hour, while in the right video, the vehicle runs at 10 km per hour. The algorithm has successfully detected the reference points in both videos. The red point is on the rear flange, while the blue point is on the edge of the rear hand. They are at the same height. We calculate the lateral distance between them in real time. 